Hello and welcome back. Today in this video I will show you how to connect your domain with Swipe Pages. And if you don't know about the Swipe Pages then this is a landing page maker with which you can create high converting AMP landing pages in minutes. As you can see the tagline here. And if you want to know more about Swipe Pages then you can watch my previous videos. And in this particular video we're gonna see how we can connect our domain with Swipe Pages. So you will have to log into your dashboard and as you can see I already have connected this domain but this is spelled as you can see the status is spelled but i'll show you how you can connect it properly and how how you can get this status connected now in order to connect your domain you will have to go to your domains then click on add new domain and here you will have to write your domain name in this format so let me copy my domain name and by the way i am connecting my domain from namecheap so as you can see i have this domain here i'll just copy this and we'll paste it here then click next and here you will have to write a subdomain now you can write a subdomain for example promo clips and so on but i'll write www just to keep my domain name then click next and the domain you are trying to add already exist so i have connected this and let me show you what you will get after this tip so let's go back to domain and here I'll just click on DNS info and this will be the third step so here as you can see you need to follow these instructions just log into your domain registrar then you get to DNS add a CNAME record and type www and your host then point to this and leave the TTL as it is click save and that's it so this will be your third step let me just copy this and if I go to Namecheap, then I'll have to go to Manage, where I can find this Advanced DNS. I'll click this, and here we can add our CNAME record. As you can see, I already have added this. So to add a new record, I'll just click on Add New Record. The type will be CNAME, which is this one. This is because Swipe Pages works with CNAME record. And uh, in host, I'll write this. And the targeted value will be this. So this is point to our value field. So copy this, paste it over here. The detail will be automatic. And then click on Save Changes. that's it and this will add a cnm record now why this is not working because because swipe pages need to turn off the proxy and to turn off the proxy you can go back to your dashboard and here you will have to turn off the proxy of your domain and unfortunately we don't have that option inside the name chip and you will have to talk to them in order to solve this as i have connected them and i'm trying to explain my issue so let's see what they say and as you can see they suggest to add a url redirect record so let's add this very quickly and to add this we can click on add new record and here let's find the url redirect and in the host we will write at the rate the destination url will be our domain name and we will leave this unmasked and we'll click save changes now let's go back and let's try refresh this the status is still failed and we will try to connect this again and this will take up to 48 hours but let's wait for this and after waiting for some time as you can see the status is now connected and we can publish our pages to this domain and to publish your pages you can go back to your pages and you can click on the page and then you can edit the url and can write your domain you will find your domain here then just click on update url and if you want to publish another page then you can close this go back and this is about page click on this you can edit the url you can choose your domain and write about or about us something like this so this was how you can connect your domain to the swipe pages and then you can publish your website. Let me show you the website.
as you can see the domain has propagated successfully this is our website so this was how you can connect your domain to swipe pages hope the video will help you if you have any questions you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next